Hello again. For my second video, I had intended to concentrate on a single release, but due to some recent developments, I've had to postpone that one. And so, we began with the beginning of Elvis's career, so this time we'll look towards the end. And we'll look at Elvis's single releases from 1970 up to the most recent. So the first release was in January. This is the American single Kentucky Rain, backed with My Little Friend on the orange label. And the reverse of the American sleeves tended to be the same image, but with the title Swap Ground. I was always very envious of American singles with their picture sleeves. In the UK, RCA tended to release them in company sleeves. So this is the one to review. But Kentucky Rain was actually one of the few with a UK sleeve. Now altogether, RCA did five picture sleeves during Elvis's life in the 70s, late 60s, 70s. And they simply use the same picture, but with different song titles. Not a lot of thought went into that. In April came the Wonder of You, backed with Mama Like the Roses. And this was a big number one hit in the UK. In July, I've Lost You, back with The Next Step Is Love. And in October, You Don't Have To Say You Love Me, back with Patch It Up. In December 1970, I really don't want to know, backed with There Goes My Everything. So five singles in one year. February 71, Where Did They Go Lord, and Rags to Riches. And in May, Life back with Only Believe. In June, I'm leaving, back with Heart of Rome. And in September, The Sound of Your Cry, which is one of my many favourites, backed with It's Only Love. In November came this bizarre cover, Merry Christmas Baby, backed with O Come All Ye Faithful. And I'll show you the reverse of this one, because on the reverse, Elvis is a snowman. A very strange cover and one of the more expensive ones to find. In January 1972, it's until it's time for you to go and we can make the morning. February, he touched me, backed with the bosom of Abraham. Again, one of the more difficult ones to find. In April 72, an American trilogy, 
back with the first time ever I saw your face. October, Burning Love, back with It's a Matter of Time. And next came Separate Ways, back with Always on My Mind. March 1973. and on the other side was Steamroller Blues from Hello from Hawaii so some bright spark thought we'll have a steamroller on the cover in September came Raised on Rock I can't actually remember what was on the B-side. Let me see. January 1974. Take good care of her. Back with I've Got a Thing About You Baby. Now when this single was released in the UK, for some reason there was a shortage of vinyl. And so the American version was imported and sold. There were some pressed in England, but they're very difficult to find. I'm still looking for one. May 1974, if you talk in your sleep, and help me. In September, Promised Land and It's Midnight. January 75, my boy, back with thinking about you. This is another difficult picture sleeve to find. In September, bringing it back and pieces of my life. T-R-O-U-B-L-E and Mr. Songman. March 1976, Hurt and For the Heart. And in November 76, Moody Blue and She Thinks I Still Care. And of course in June of 1977, way down, back with pledging my love. And of course as we all know, on August the 16th, Elvis passed away. The first posthumous release came in November, my way backed with America the Beautiful. In March 78, Unchained Melody, backed with Softly As I Leave You. And in July, Teddy Bear, backed with Puppet on a String. In March 1979, are you sincere? Backed with solitaire. And this is a limited beige vinyl release. Quite how limited some of these are is open to question. July 79. I've got a feeling in my body. Back with there's a honky tonk angel. In January of 81, 
guitar man, backed with faded love. Next comes a strange single. It's the only American release with no official picture sleeve. Loving Arms. The story I've heard is that a picture sleeve was created, but at the last moment it was pulled because Elvis was smoking a cigar. Uh, and apparently in Joan Deary's archive was the intended picture sleeve, and since then some have been uh, printed. And so this is apparently what the Loving Arms picture sleeve would have looked like. In February 82, there goes my everything, back with You'll Never Walk Alone. In October 1982, came the Elvis medley, back with Blue Suede Shoes. In April 1983, we got I Was The One, backed with Wear My Ring Around Your Neck. And in June, Paralyzed, back with Little Sister. In August 84, Baby Let's Play House and Hound Dog, and this was on gold vinyl, or yellow vinyl, and I actually got this in Memphis on the day of its release. September of 84, Blue Suede Shoes, back with Promised Land. In April 85, Always On My Mind, and My Boy. And in November, Merry Christmas Baby. Santa Claus is back in town. Now have a gap up to February 1996 when we got Heartbreak Hotel. In August 97, King of the Whole Wide World. And then a gap up to November 2015, when we got If I Can Dream. Now in those gaps, they were generally releasing CD singles. There were also a lot of reissues, collectible labels, gold standard labels, etc. So that's Elvis's American releases. Now I'm not going to go through all of the UK releases because they're pretty much the same. But after Elvis's death, the UK did have some UK only releases. So, very quickly, It's Only Love with Beyond the Reef. I've got to number two in the charts. Santa Claus is back in town, back with I Believe. The UK did get a, an official sleeve for Loving Arms, back with You Ask Me Too. The Sound of Your Cry, 
and I'll never know. And we also got a picture sleeve of the same single. Next came I Can Help and The Lady Loves Me. Green Green Grass of Home on the B-side Release Me on Solitaire. And the sleeve is in fact a, a poster. The last farewell, it's easy for you. We've got the Elvis medley, but as a picture disc. We also had it with the same sleeve as the American one. And then came a picture disc. Oops. Baby, I don't care. Always on my mind, back with tomorrow night. Ain't that loving you, baby? The fast version. Back with Bossa Nova Baby. Love Me Tender. Back with If I Can Dream. Stuck on You. With Any Way You Want Me. Mean Woman Blues. I Beg of You. Are You Lonesome Tonight? The Laughing Version with From a Jack to a King. A four track, seven inch, Don't Be Cruel, All Shook Up, JLS Rock, I Need Your Love Tonight. And the Twelfth of Never, back with Walk a Mile in My Shoes and Burning Love. That covers Elvis's 1970s American and UK releases up to today. Hopefully my next video will be how many times can you buy the same record. I'm waiting on two new additions to arrive, hopefully next week. Thank you to everyone that watched my first video and left comments. Bye for now.